All right, it's May 24th, 2022, and Raptor legend Norman Powell is about to get randomly harassed at a boxing gym in Vegas by some woman who just shows up on the scene. And while Norm stays calm the entire time, uh, she experiences a roller coaster of emotions. She's angry. <laughs> she's confused. Oh, crazy. She's horny. She's cultured. Sonora. She's lit. I am on something. So first we see the two inside the boxing gym, and it's crazy right from the get-go. You're not American. How am I not American? How are we not I was, American? I was born and raised here. I, my family. My descendants is from Africa, yes. My family. But I am American. I was born Mayflower, here. And I was a slave. Mm, how were you a slave? My what made you a slave? Because I was black. And, and, and now I'm not Joseph Mengele or anything here, but this woman might not be white. I'm leaning definitely more towards red, but she's not black. I mean, she's not even Tyler Hero black. And, and Norm trolls her with a bit of uh, culture here, which she actually, to her credit, riffs a little bit. You are black? Yes. You got Reva Deligo? You like Uncle Ruckus? You seen the Boondocks? You like Uncle Ruckus? I like. You like you got you got Reva Deligo? I like the blues. What does that have to do with anything? But then it all goes downhill from there when we go outside. Now I'm not sure if it's just the rage or she's been left out in the sun too long, but she is very red. Um, she looks like she could hop into a bisque at any point here. Killer outfit though, you know, leather boots, the fake yoga pants. I mean, Love Las Vegas shirt with a cougar kind of you know real estate agent haircut. And and now some folks would be grossed out by a woman like this, but I mean, if this is your thing. I mean, you can find this woman on Plenty of Fish in any number of Canadian jurisdictions. I, I put it out uh, to the Discord community. A um, few suggestions were Timmins, Flin Flon, Bruce County, Innisfil, Red Deer, and Nanaimo as, as hotspots. And, you know, I won't judge. You know, I used to be a blackout drinker. You know, we've all been there, and everybody deserves love at the end of the day. But, and on that note, she just randomly starts taking her clothes off. <laughs> Um, she goes into Spanish. In Mexico, where is I'm his Guercito? Guercito. You see this crazy Guercito shit in Vegas. Guercito from Sonora. Yeah, you know, you know who I'm talking about, Guercito. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, oh, this I'm is crazy. Guercito. She gotta be on something. I am on something. Planet Earth. Vegas is crazy, it man. Seems like everyone is. But on to the main event. She doesn't really get a training session into the boxing gym. You know, she does, however, get into a physical conflict with someone much more skilled than her. So maybe it was a bit of a, a lesson in martial arts. Ow! Ow! <laughs> Here's where things get, you know, a little conspiratorial. She's going to get injured, you know, here on the takedown and the arrest. But then somehow she blames the injury on, on Nora. I'm not sure if she's gaslighting. Oh, I was here for the... Your wrist wasn't wasn't broke when you was trying to touch us. No, it's broken. I have it on freaking X-ray. And, and she also lets us know this is not her first rodeo. Last police department. Got you. Yeah, like Norm chirps back a bit. You know, Norm's always chill. He always has that like I've just smoked half a joint kind of vibe. That was some good excitement for today. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> it is crazy. I said you broke my wrist. Shorty was talking crazy. Oh my god, man. Also, I'm doing full game commentaries now on Patreon. I just did uh, Lakers Raptors, the LeBron hissy fit game against Scotty Barnes, and then I did a throwback from 2000 Vince Carter Raptors era against the Vancouver Grizzlies, where I got angry and stuff. But yeah, it's you know check it out.